in today's video we are going to be looking at how to use the format painter how to use the format painter so if you look at uh, this um, worksheet you can see that in the worksheet you have different types of font style different types of designs and stuff like that probably you were sharing the form and people were filling in with different handwritten ha ha different types of fonts and probably you've looked at it and uh, maybe you found a nice one uh, let's say probably in, in terms of country you prefer this United Kingdom style uh, the way it's being written or you prefer the Ireland and Ukraine style or you prefer the Austria and Sweden style or even probably if you prefer the Germany and Italy style or even France so what you need to do is if you come down you can even see Malta style you can see if you come to this place probably want all the country style to be in our United Kingdom font style all you need to do is to come to click on format painter uh, if you click on format painter you're gonna come here <coughs> sorry click on format painter um, before you do that you're gonna select the one you want so let's go back I um, think uh, let's go back so okay you want to use United Kingdom style to make effect to all these um, country styles. All you need to do is select the style you want. You want this style, you go to Format Painter, you click on Format Painter. You can see what they wrote in Format Painter. They say, like the look of a particular selection, like the look of a particular selection, you can apply that look to other content in the document. To get started, select content with the formatting you like. You see, that's why we selected United Kingdom. Click Format Painter, select something else. To automatically apply the formatting to apply the formatting in multiple places double click format painter to apply it in multiple places you do what double click format painter so if you look at this now we want to apply it in germany italy and france either of us selecting and changing it one after the other and so on we want because to uh, want to apply it in ireland and stuff like that so all i need to do is to come to format painter and double click on it once you double click on it, you're going to select Germany and France. You can see that if you select Germany and France, it has effect and you're still holding the format painter uh, icon. You come to Poland and Belgium. You can see that. You scroll down, you come to Ireland and Malta. You can see that. So everything automatically has gone. I've changed. You can see every style has changed and you're still holding the format painter. So any other place you want to make effect on, you can see select it and you're going to have the same effect. Let's say you want to do it here again. You're going to see it. You can see that's so beautiful. So this is how you can use the format painter. Now, if you, if you click just once, if you click just once, um, let's say you in, in terms of... Um, the educational level you want to you can see this bsc has a color right in the terms of educational level you want this style to be in this format you want it to have a font um, background color of blue so you can just if you single click if you click once you're going to have it has effect on just one you can just do that for once you can see that the format painter icon will disappear but if you do that if you double click on it double click twice that is click twice if you click twice you're going to use it to have effect on different places you can see that so once you do that you're going to have it has effect on all different places you can see that so uh, that is the beauty of double clicking on the format painter so let's uh drop back the format painter to drop it just go back to format painter and drop it uh, too so you can see now the way it is now let's say you like uh, the formatting of this name or let's say you like the formatting of age just click on age double click on format painter now let's say i want to use this for age formatting and replace the name so i just come to name and select the name you can see that once i select the name it has effect on it you can see that so let's say i want to drop it i want to drop the format Painter, go back and click on it it drops so you can see how beautiful it is so everything depends on what do you want and what do you not want now if you come to the age every age has a different formatting so you can decide to choose any one of your choice let's say uh let's say we prefer on the visible age that is darker let's say we prefer this you just come to format painter and double click on format painter once you double click on format painter you select every other 
one you want to have the same formatting with it and you just release your hand and everything goes to that so you draw back your format painter this is basically how to use the format painter instead of you giving the effect one after the other you can just simply use the format painter to do that so thanks and this is just it so you can see how beautiful it is let's just zoom in so that you can see the beauty uh, <laughs> so you can see the beauty you can see how beautiful it is and stuff like that so yeah that's it thanks for watching